not too many days go by that I don't think about her and tears well up in my eyes. She was a special girl, very special. A Fort Pierce family sleeping a little easier tonight. The man who allegedly hit and killed 14-year-old Brittany Hare as she walked along a neighborhood street is now under arrest. News Channel 5's Angela Cruz, part of the largest news team covering the Treasure Coast, and she joins us from Fort Pierce tonight with the story. Angela? Good evening, Kelly. Jesse McInerney is actually sitting behind bars as we speak at the St. Lucie County Jail. Deputies here at the St. Lucie County Sheriff's Office arrested him today on the charges you see on this report. He's facing charges of DUI manslaughter, attempted leaving the scene of an accident with death, and vehicular homicide. On July 14th, 14-year-old Brittany Hare was walking down Palm Drive in Fort Pierce when witnesses say McInerney hit her from behind killing her. We're told toxicology reports show he was driving with multiple drugs in his system, including cocaine. Just over a month later, now that he's in jail, Bertha Spears says it's the beginning of justice for her granddaughter. We never expected, and it was very hard walking in there, seeing her laying there, knowing that, you know, we'd never see her laugh or smile or anything again. It was very hard. It's closure for the family to know that he is finally behind bars. Jesse McInerney is going to actually go before a judge tomorrow morning for his first appearance in court. Until then, he remains in jail tonight with no bond for two of his charges. Reporting live in Fort Pierce, Angela Cruz, WPTV News Channel 5.